Hello, 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 everyone, and welcome to training presented by Risk TV. Hopefully, you guys are enjoying all the training that we are giving here on Risk TV on, on Forex, and hopefully, you guys can join the team and start making pips with us. So, furthermore, let's talk about the Forex pip. You all probably heard of the term pips, points, pipettes, and lots thrown around. And now we're going to explain what they are and show you how their values are calculated. So pips are important to a forex trader in order to have success. So before you start trading with the forex market, get comfortable with the pips values and calculated pro profit and loss. Unit of measurement to, to express the change in value between two currencies is called a pip. So as you can see here, we have the Euro USD and the USD JPY, which are two pairs. We have two pairs, and it's Euro and USD JPY. So if the Euro USD moves from 1.1150 to 1151, that is a 0 0.001 USD rise in value is one pip. As you can see right here, if Euro USD goes up, then this pip right here will go up. As you can see right there. So that'll be one pip. So a uh, pip is usually the last decimal place of a price quote. Most pairs go to four decimal places, but there are some exceptions like the Japanese yen pair. They go to two decimal places, as you can see right here. So for example, for the Euro USD, it is 0 0.001. And for the USD JPY, it is 0 0.01. So fractional pips, there are points or pipettes. So these points or pipette, which are fractional, um, fractional pips, equal to a tenth of a pip. So for instance, if a GPUSD moves from 130542 to 1.30543, that is a 0 0.00001 USD move higher and is a one pipette. So if you can see right here, if the, we are trading the euro USD and the pipette goes, let's say you, you have, you're in a, a cell for the USD, right? Then this pipette right here is one tenth of a pip, which is the number five. So the number five is the pip, and the number four is the pipette, which is one tenth of the pip. So if we are in the cell on a euro USD, then this pipette will be going down. So if it moved by 0. 001, then this pipette will go to three. But if it moves 10 pipettes, that's one pip. So this five will go into a four. And then the same thing with your USD. If we go in for a buy on the your USD and this zero gets moved up by one, that is one pip pip. But if this four, which is the pip, goes up to five, then that means 10 pipettes equals one pip. And you can see right here in this picture right here, the your USD, this is how it will look in when you're trading with a platform. So as you can see right here, you have the 1.36 to one on one. So the big numbers are the pip. These small numbers right here in the red, those are the pipettes. And that will be the end of our training today. Hopefully you guys learned a quick study of um, what is the pips and we will have more training for everyone here on Bridge TV. Thank you guys and have a beautiful day.